Hello everybody, welcome to a special kid present. It's my cam phone and I'm getting ready to talk to somebody on it. One of the best selling authors of all times. Hello, I'm Kid President. Introduce yourself to all these people. So I'm Paulo Coelho, I'm a writer. You're a smart guy. Have you traveled a lot? Yes, but, I, but there, well, there are many, 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 many things that uh, uh, I did for for United Nations as a messenger of peace. But I think the most important thing is yet to be done, that it is, uh, well, uh, be a tool, be an instrument of, of, of not helping. I don't like this idea of helping people, but empowering people, you know, make people to understand that they themselves can change everything. What counts is not what they think, but what they do. So people must uh, do uh, and not only think about it. For World Humanitarian Day, we're asking people what the world needs more of. What do you think the world needs more of? Well, I do believe that first people need to act and people need to realize that they have power. It's not the politicians that have power. The power belongs to the people. And finally, uh, uh, I would like to see them, like they were riding motorcycles, motorcycles of hope, motorcycles of, of, of uh, enthusiasm, uh, things like this. Let's break the world record with most motorcycle wheelies together. <laughs> Well, when I was in the Mojave Desert, uh, I wrote a book called The Valkyries. I was there and I, I did not break the record because I'm really scared of motorcycles. But I think motorcycles is a good metaphor. Uh, people are scared, but from the moment that you jump in a motorcycle, you, you have nothing to lose and you have this contact with the wind, you have this contact with nature. You really are there. You, belong, you become one with uh, everything. Well, I want to change the world. How do I do that? Well, you can follow my example. <laughs> Sorry to be so... Uh, when I became this f famous author, so to say, I thought I'm going to, I'm going to change my country, Brazil. And then I realized that I could not change Brazil. And then I realized I could not change Rio de Janeiro, the state. And then I realized that I could not change Copacabana. Uh, the neighborhood, but I could change my neighborhood. So uh, we went to see a uh, favela, a Islam city uh, nearby, and we start changing 430 children. And the energy of these 430 children uh, start spreading all over, all over the Islam city. And after 96, after 15 years, this zone is now uh, a model for, 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 for this. Because we did not think, let's change Brazil. We thought, let's change what we can change, that it is our neighborhood. Don't just talk about being awesome, do it. So, Mr. Kid President, thank you very much for giving me this opportunity to talk to you. I hope that you use your mandate to, to really make important changes. Uh, being a kid, you have this uh, innocence, not naivety, but innocence that you think that everything is possible. And from the moment that everything is possible, uh, things become possible. Uh, thank you for believing. Let's go ride more cycles one time, man. Bye-bye, thank you. It's about celebrating people who make the world more awesome. Everything is possible. Thank you for being my friend.